So folks, of course, you know, I do this install and I've done tons of BIOS update videos for y'all. Oh yeah, you need to update this BIOS for uh, 13th gen, blah, blah, blah. What did yours truly do? I did not update the BIOS before I installed 13th gen in here. Um, yeah, real smart, right? You know, that's, I guess, age there, I'm getting old. Uh, so, you know, the message you're going to see from this motherboard, which is a pretty awesome motherboard. If I can turn it on right. These lights are going to flash, and then potentially there's some kind of code that shows back here. This will alternate back and forth. No, you're not going to see a picture, right? And so basically, you know the title of this, this picture uh, or this video is, you know, what happens when you install 13th gen and you don't have a BIOS update. And then we'll put this motherboard as part of the title too. But yeah, nothing is going to happen. Black screen, lights that alternate, maybe some kind of code. So we've got to update the BIOS. Now, I'm going to make a separate video from this one. Where I actually update the BIOS with all this hardware installed. So we'll use the BIOS flashback button. And this is a perfect situation for this because if you bought this new and you get it and you're like, well, it's been a while since 13 Gen came out. Hopefully it's got an updated BIOS. Wrong Ola, right? So then you have to go and get the actual BIOS uh, to make it work. So thanks for checking out the video, folks. Please like, please subscribe. Thank you.